In this video, we'll walk through the process of converting PTC MathCAD worksheets from MathCAD 15 into MathCAD Prime. The process to convert worksheets from MathCAD 15 or worksheets from earlier legacy versions of MathCAD into MathCAD Prime is initiated from within MathCAD Prime. Let's go ahead and convert a worksheet now. Here in MathCAD Prime, on the ribbon, we have an input output tab on the left hand side. If we click on the input output tab, we'll see that directly underneath the tab, we have a button called XMCD MCD Converter. Clicking on this button will open a window where we can load files that we wish to convert. On the left side of this window, we have a button to add worksheets. Let's click on the Add Worksheets button, and here we can select worksheets that we wish to convert. We can load the converter with a single worksheet, or we can load up multiple worksheets. Once our worksheets are loaded, we'll notice that the status is left blank because these worksheets have not yet been converted. We'll select all the desired worksheets and use the Convert button to start the conversion process. The status for a given worksheet changes to In Progress, and once the conversions are complete, the status will again change to indicate that the conversion process has finished. Once complete, we'll see a conversion log at the bottom of this window. We'll look at the conversion log and read through any messages that the worksheet converter wishes to convey to us. To view the conversion log for a different file in our list, we'll select the file at the top of the window and view the conversion log accordingly in the lower half of the window. For this particular file conversion on the Spring Optimization Worksheet, we see that there were a few display differences between the original file and the new file that was created in MathCAD Prime. When a file has been converted, the original is left intact, unedited, and unaltered. A new file in MathCAD Prime is created and is stored in the same directory adjacent to the original file. We'll close this window and now we're ready to look at our new MathCAD Prime file. We'll go to the M Prime icon in the upper left corner of MathCAD Prime and open our MathCAD Prime worksheet. Once we open a converted file, we will initially be opening a converted but uncalculated worksheet in MathCAD Prime. The first thing we'll do is go to the Calculate tab on the ribbon and press the Calculate button to ensure the worksheet is calculated. Now notice that we see annotations throughout the worksheet that map to the messages that were listed in the conversion log. Thinking back to those messages, we saw that there were some display differences on certain operators between the original file and the new file. Those display differences are annotated for our reference in the MathCAD Prime file. When we click on the region, including an annotation, we'll see the message. In this case, the message says, the display of this operator has changed from the source worksheet. The accuracy of the results is not affected. Now we'll scroll down to take a look at what the rest of this worksheet looks like in MathCAD Prime. Once we're satisfied, with the annotations, and once we've validated that everything is acceptable, we'll go to the top of the ribbon and again on the Input Output tab, locate the Clear Annotations button. Clearing the annotations using this button will clear all the red lines in the MathCAD Prime file. Let's go ahead and do that now. Once we clear the annotations, we'll see that the new file in MathCAD Prime looks very clean. And this concludes our short video on how to convert your worksheets from MathCAD 15 into MathCAD Prime.